These kids are Australia's next generation of seed superheroes. They're suited up and on a mission to save our native plants from the brink of extinction. That sounds dramatic, and it's actually true. They're helping out the WA Seed Centre, which collects and stores thousands of seeds from different plant species. There's over 400 um, plant species in Western Australia that we consider to be threatened with extinction, um, and that's a significant number of plants. Seeds are basically plant embryos with a protective coating over the top, where they rest until conditions are right to grow into a new plant. That makes them ideal for storing in seed banks. They exist all over the world. The biggest one is in Norway and holds more than a million different types of seeds. They're kind of like an insurance policy, making sure that these species can be regrown if something bad happens. Like natural disasters, outbreaks of disease, climate change or even war. The WA Seed Bank concentrates on native plants that are only found in Western Australia both by storing seeds for the future and replanting them in the wild to help the species grow again. But they need lots of seeds to do that. And that's where these kids come in. They've been given seeds of a plant called Showy Everlasting. It's only found in four places in the world and all of them are in Western Australia. It's up to them to plant the flowers in their school garden, help to care for them and eventually harvest the seeds so they can be stored in the seed bank. The kids almost adopt these plants and it's like almost like having a pet. So this is basically the fun way of learning. Instead of just like watching videos and finding out about it, instead we could actually do it in real life and experience it and, and that gives us another job opportunity. Like we could become a scientist. Collecting seeds from plants can be tricky because you have to know where the seed head is. On flowers, that's usually the middle bit and it's ready to harvest when the flower starts to die off. In nature, they're often picked up by birds or blown around in the wind, and that's how plants spread. Here at the school, these kids are proud that they're helping to protect the future of native plants. I think the school is playing an important role because they're basically like save, saving the seeds. And um, if we don't do this, they might go extinct because the plants they help us breathe and stuff so like if we run out of them then um, like future generations won't get to see like the amazingness of the plants. Saving the world one seed at a time. <laughs>